Our next entertainer has appeared on Good Morning America, The Today Show, and CNN. His viral magic videos have been viewed over 10 million times on YouTube. And he is currently appearing on this season of Wizard Wars on the Sci-Fi Network. Please help me welcome magician Rob Anderson. All right. What's up, man? Thank you. Thank you. I'm so excited to be here. You know, I'm a little bit embarrassed, though. I realized I wore my old shirt. <laughs> Get it? Says, says old. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> Any love for the V-neck? I got a couple cool things I want to show you guys today. Uh, first one is a classic of magic. Just means it's a really old trick. Use a couple of completely ordinary items. This has been around for like over 100 years, guys. It's entertained audiences for generations. First item is a big old candle. I stole this from church. Second item is a completely ordinary magic cloth. My ex-girlfriend used to call this a prom dress. This is easy to follow. It's been around forever, you guys. This is easy. Check it out. The cloth goes over the candle in an instant. The candle turns into a rose. Excellent. You laugh. Good one. You laugh. But Helen Keller loved that trick. <laughs> How about this? Have you guys seen the uh, Chinese linking ring? Show of hands. Who's seen this trick where the rings link together? The Chinese linking rings. Everyone's seen this, right? Okay, everybody seen this? Cool. All right, that'll save some time. All right. I want to show you guys one of my favorite things to do using this piece of rope. It's not what you're thinking. It's magic. Check it out. Right here. Uh, sir, you can ch check that piece of rope out right there. Check that out. Make sure it's an ordinary piece of rope. There's nothing unusual about it. It doesn't come apart. It doesn't stretch. There's no maggots or hidden pieces or anything weird in there. You can look at that rope as close as you want to, because I'm going to use this rope right here. This is the rope I'll be using. Now, this is going to be a weird question. What's your name, though? Uh, Derek. That's not the weird question, Derek. The weird question, have you ever done karate? Yes. Yes? Cool. Well, that's actually the first time anyone's ever said yes to that question. Well, thanks for killing my joke for the next part of the trip, but that's cool, though. Derek, well, are you a, like a black belt or anything? Definitely not. All right, well, do this anyway. Put one hand in the air for your best karate chop. One hand up like this for a karate chop. You're going to come down and chop this rope on the count of three, chopping it cleanly in half. One, two, three, karate chop. Oh, my gosh, Derek, you're a black belt. You didn't even know it. Look at that. It's amazing. We're going to do the three-rope trick. It uses, starts off with two ropes, actually, that are exactly the same length. And Derek's karate chop has made these ropes exactly not even close. Derek, you just told me you were a black belt. No, it's all right. We do need two ropes that are exactly the same length for this trick. We're just going to go back in time for just a second. And when I had one rope, you had one rope. Go ahead and toss that back up here to me. Toss it right up here to me. Okay, that's how I made the chess team. All right. <laughs> now we're going to get back to that. We do need two ropes that are exactly the same length, so here's what we'll do. We'll take this rope here. We'll take the ends right here in the middle, right here. No, that's wrong. They need to switch. Sorry. Okay. We'll take one of the ends right here like that. We'll squeeze it. We'll pop it out that end right there. We'll take one of the other ends right there. We'll squeeze it. We'll pop it out that end right there. Derek, check that piece of rope out. Make sure that is an ordinary piece of rope. It doesn't come apart. It doesn't stretch. Come on, that's amazing. It's incredible. Derek, one more karate chop right here. We're going to chop this rope right in half. Oh my gosh, Derek's on a roll today. We're going to do the three rope trick. One, two, you've got the third one. Toss it back up here to me. Now on the money. Nice. The three rope trick uses three ropes that are exactly the same length, and these are not even close. It's okay. We'll use a little bit of magic. We should be able to get these to stretch just like that. It's amazing! This is incredible! The laws of physics are bending before your eyes! This is awesome! I thought. <laughs> these ropes seem like they're the same length now. They seem like they're the same length, but here in Vegas, not everything is as it seems. Just ask the uh, girl I met last night. Oh, 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 Helen Keller was okay, but oh. We're going to bring this full circle. we got to do this full circle. With a little snap, we should be able to get these to go back to a small, a medium, on one very long piece of rope. That's one of my favorite tricks. <laughs> you guys, I want to thank you guys so much for having me here today. This has been a lot of fun. My name's Rob Anderson. Look for me on YouTube. Thank you guys so much. See you later.